to work at a school, you have to care about the kids. That's a given, right? But you also have to be alert and ready to step in whenever there's a problem. Hey, and boy, is that what one cafeteria worker did at Paddle High School. This happened yesterday when she realized a student was choking. Our Lindsay Bucking has the story. Kids Combo, you're all set. Megan Kulikowski does this every day at Padua High. Hi, hon, how are you? She's a cafeteria worker who knows everyone's name. Rylan, you got grill combo, you're all set, thank you. And Ethan, you've got grill and a cookie. And she cares about every single person in this room. So it's no surprise that she jumped into help Wednesday as she was standing at the checkout. And then a student came to the side of me and kind of almost interrupting, so I would kind of turned my head to see what was going on and she leaned in and she said help and it was very struggle. Megan quickly realized the student was choking. I yelled for help and then I threw my arms around her and then I yelled for help again and uh, just craziness and then I looked down on the ground and there was a bottle cap. Because of Megan's quick thinking to perform the Heimlich maneuver, that student is doing just fine. She's still a little too shaken to talk about it, but her mother did send a message for Megan. She saved my daughter's life yesterday, and we are so truly blessed to have her and the rest of the cafeteria staff looking out for our kids. I don't even know what else to say other than thank you, and you are such a hero. I appreciate that greatly. I've seen these kids since they were four years old growing up. It just, it's just want to make sure everybody's healthy and happy. You'll notice Megan doesn't want the credit, but Principal Bob DiRocco says she deserves it. Well, she's very humble. She doesn't want any attention, uh, but I reminded her that you still have to act and react, and it was really a big deal. Megan, we think you're a big deal just for being yourself. We all love all these students so much, and we just want the best for them. And Principal DiRocco stressed to us the workers in that school get great training in the beginning of each school year. Jay and Christy, that training allowed Megan to respond in the way that she did, which ultimately saved a life. Wow, what a great story. And I know there's a, there's a, a theme with heroes. Lindsay, you've probably seen this because I know you've done several stories with this. Almost every time they say, no, I'm really not a hero. I was just doing what I was supposed to do. Yeah. They're so humble, but yeah. they deserve the credit, and certainly Megan does, too. They yeah. do, and she is a hero. Oh, Great story, Lindsay. Thank you so Thanks, much. Thanks, Lindsay.